So in this video, I will give you a clinical case scenario and we can discuss the nerve injury associated with this uh, case. <laughs> so in this case, we have a patient who's injured in the leg. He has a cast put on and now he presents to the office with pain and numbness to the dorsum of his foot. And he cannot dorsiflex the ankle on that same leg. So which nerve is affected and where is the size of the injury? So from the stem of the questions, we see that the patient presents with numbness to the dorsum of his foot. And we know that uh, sensory innervation to the dorsum of the foot is, is supplied by the superficial fibular nerve. So this is the nerve right here, superficial, another name for this nerve, superficial perineal nerve. It's called superficial fibular nerve because it travels along the fibula right here, and it's a branch of the common fibular nerve. And the common fibular nerve wraps uh, wraps laterally around the head of the fibula. It's very superficial and it can be injured very easily due to uh, trauma to the lateral side or if um, the cast is put on too tightly. And the common mm, uh, fibular nerve also give uh, give a branch uh, a branch gives out a branch called the uh, deep fibular nerve. Another presentation that this patient presents uh, with is the inability to dorsiflex the ankle. <clears throat> so dorsiflexion of the foot is done by the tibialis anterior muscle. And the tibialis anterior muscle is part of a group of muscles on the interior compartments of the leg. And the uh, muscles in the interior compartments of the leg is supplied by the deep fibular nerve. So the patient presents with the neural deficits of both the superficial fibular nerve and the deep fibular nerve. And both of these are branches of the common fibular nerve. So if there's uh, a lesion at this level, the level of the common fibular nerve, then it would affect both the superficial uh, uh, fibular nerve, which cause pain and numbness to the dorsum of the foot, and also the deep fibular nerve, which cause the inability to dorsiflex the ankle. So the site of the injury is most likely uh, around the head, at the head of the fibula, because at this level, the common fibular nerve is very superficially located, and it wraps around the head of the fibula at this level. So if there is an injury or trauma, on the lateral side of the leg, it will either um, injure, it will injure the common fibular nerve at this uh, level, or in as in this case, the cast was put on and it was uh, it was tightly put on, so it compresses the um, the common fibular nerve at this level, it, and therefore it also causes the same deficits that we uh, see in this patient. So. So to recap, the nerve, the nerve that is affected in this patient is the common fibular nerve, and the site of the injury is at uh, the neck uh, of the mm, fibula because at that level, the common fibular nerve is superficially located, and uh, it's uh, wrapped around the neck of the fibula.